working on these veterans gifts for Memorial Day. It's actually, the event's actually on Friday. It's just honoring our veterans. So it's a Memorial Day um, celebration and that is going to be on Friday. So I have to get this stuff ready. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to do on um, basket number one. I'm also going to show you guys how to shrink wrap. Um, Mama for Nicole asked me if I can go a little bit slower with the shrink wrapping process. So I'm going to do that. But, um, these little containers my neighbor didn't want so I took them from her I don't know where she got them at but they are pretty nifty and this was a complete freebie for me I'm like yes I will take them because I'm going to use them for this event so um, if you're watching I know you're not watching but I know my baby girl is Jamie Grace tell your mom I said thank you they are going to a good cause and good use so in the basket, I'm going to put a dark velvet candle from the Dollar Tree. It smells very manly. I also have some Bath & Body Works Ultra Cream Lotion, some Cypress Body Wash. We have this Bold Stripes Bright Stars Brave Hearts. I believe I got this at the Dollar Tree. I want to say it was the Dollar Tree. It could have been the 99. I'm pretty sure. Momentum brand, so it could be either or, but I'm pretty sure it was the Dollar Tree. And then this is a clearance fine I found last year they were 90 percent off so this was 30 cents so i'm going to add that and then i'm also adding this big the big one plush throw now um these i found at clearance at big lots for 90 percent off actually this was at kohl's um i don't remember how much it is because i blacked out the price 39.90 so this was three dollars and 99 cents it was 90 percent off so not a bad deal on that so I'm gonna add this in here. And then I have, I purchased these at the Dollar Tree. It came in a package of two. I have this red, white, and blue um, American flag, which I'm just going to like kind of lean over like this. I'm gonna stuff half of this with newspaper. I have my newspaper right here. And I'll show you guys how I put this okay, together. So this is what I have so far. I have the blanket here. I did um, lean over the red, white, and blue, like a little handkerchief right there. This um, a bold stripes, it had a string in the back and I was able to uh, safety pin it back here. So when I shrink wrap it, I think it'll look really cute when it's standing up. That's why it's leaned against this love seat right here. Now, of course I have my tissue right here and I'm gonna go ahead and put my the rest of my items in, which of course is my candle. And then I have this little car here. Then I have my body wash that in the back and then my lotion I also have a loofah so let me add this but I think this is a really nice little raffle gift and I think they're really gonna like it after I shrink wrap it it'll be ready to go and then we'll start on the next one okay guys I did add the simply spa me exfoliating men's body scrubber to this and I think this is a very nice raffle gift it's also a great father's day gift I mean you do not have to do the red white and blue stuff you can just leave it as is take this off take the signage off or maybe put one of those dad signages on there and that would be a perfect Perfect Father's Day gift super cute really expensive inexpensive for me this probably cost me less than ten dollars to make I got this for 30 cents a dollar 30 this was free this was 3.99 so that is 4.99 five dollars and 29 cents these you know we got um at the uh, semi-annual so they were like let's say less than three dollars each so that's three six nine ninety nine um ten ninety nine $11.29, $12.29, $13.29 plus the shrink wrap, so less than $15 for this whole entire gift. And the retail value is 40, 43, 44. You still have the prices on them? Yes, 14.50, so that's $29. That's 50, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57 plus the shrink wrap. This is a $60 gift, but I only paid less than $15 for the whole entire gift. So that's a way you guys can, you know, save, buy it on clearance now, save it for gifts later. And you're saving a ton of money rather than going out and trying to find this whole entire gift. You already have it in your stock and you spent less than $15 
for a $60 Father's Day gift. Okay, let's move on to the next one. That we put together for these veterans. We have four World War II vets coming to this event tomorrow, which would be on Friday. And I'm super excited about it because they're over 90 and they um, are coming to this event and taking the time out of their day to come. So it's really really special. Now, um, they requested a bag to hold their electronics and I was looking for like a backpack or a fanny pack. I just couldn't find it. And I had such short notice that they were gonna, they RCP'd so short that um, I couldn't go out and really look. So I did find these courier bags. I hope this is okay. This I found at the 99 cent only store. They are pretty sturdy. Like they're very nice material. For only 99 cents, I picked up four. I did pick up four of the flashlights that they sell at the 99 and then I, I of course put batteries in them. But these are actually really nice and they're kind of heavy when you put the batteries in. So I picked up four red and blues. And then um, four handkerchiefs. These we purchased at like a t-shirt shop along with these California red, white, and blue. And they have little, um, they're of the flag t-shirts. So three and a large, and then the bright red is the extra large. And then my husband stopped by and he picked up these World War II veteran proudly served caps that I think they're really gonna like. So that is gonna be um, another one of our donations to this event and little gifts that we're going to give to these World War II vets. Okay guys, so all I did was pretty much just put everything in the bag and then I tied a ribbon around the hat and the um, handle. So I think these came out really cute. The red satin bow, um, the ribbon was actually donated. So I think I'm putting it to good use. So let's move I'm on. Working on a ladies veterans gift. So at the bottom, um, I got these handkerchiefs. They were two for 99, I'm sorry, two for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. I wish I would have picked up more. Underneath of course is good old paper. And I'm just gonna fill it with some items. So I have here a go for it. Um, this is the watermark collection from the 99 cent only store. I got this at the sale when they were um, half off. So this retails for $1.99. I got it for 99 cents. These were at the 99 cent only store. This is the purifying um, botanical bath tea herbal steam. So this is gonna be for a lady veteran. And then I have the purify detoxifying essential oils. I have this really cute TY um, bear I'm going to be putting in the basket as well as these deep pore cleansing strips. If you saw my 99 cent only store haul, you know I picked up quite a bit of items at four for 99 cents. So these were four for 99 cents at the 99 cent only store. So I'm going to add that. I'm also going to add one of these that I hauled four for 99 cents. So I'm going to add that. I am going to add this Glamour palette. These were two for 99 cents at the 99 cent only store. If you guys have not seen that haul, I will post that at the end of this video so you guys can take a look. And then I have this Elite Pro Beauty set. Now this one I paid 5 dollars for, but the other ones that I found were two for 99 cents. I thought this was really pretty. So I'm gonna add that there. And then also a two for 99 cent eight piece nail polish pamper set. And then of course a basket. I'm going to put it through. The basket was given to me by my neighbor. She was trying to declutter her house. So I took all of these from her and in front I'm gonna put this America sign so let me put everything together and I'll show you guys what it hey looks guys, like I think it came out so cute and I think it's gonna look really cute I'm going to shrink wrap this um, I told mama for Nicole I would record my shrink wrapping skills so she can see it I have one more basket I'm going to show you and then we'll start shrink wrapping inside, well attached to the gifts we are going to attach these little thank you cards and inside it says on Memorial Day, as I honor America's fallen heroes, I will also be remembering your service and sacrifice for our country. Thank you for keeping America safe and free. As a proud patri patriotic citizen, I am forever grateful for all you have given. Sincerely, the Richard Brunick Foundation. So that's my nonprofit's name, and we're gonna put that right here. So I'm gonna show you how I'm going to assemble this next okay, gift. So my next gift is going to be like a barbecue themed related gift. Now this can be actually a really great Father's Day gift, and it's pretty inexpensive. So this box is from Daiso, but you can also find one at Dollar Tree to match. Um, I just used any tissue because you're not really gonna see it. And of course it's stuffed with good old newspaper. Now I do have this Good Times and Grill Lines um, kitchen towel from the Dollar Tree. I also have a um, pot holder from the Dollar Tree. I picked up one of those bamboo cutting boards that you guys were talking about so much. I picked up one of those. 
And then I also picked up the Barbecue Boss My Girl My Rolls. I hauled this all in my Dollar Tree haul, which was um, posted on Monday if you want to take a look at that. But um, I think this is a really cute sign and this is also going to go in the box. Now I have my thank you card and then I have some peanuts from the Dollar Tree, some honey roasted peanuts some salted peanuts. I also have two packages of some teriyaki beef jerky. I have this really cute stars and stripes like little decor piece and this was from the 99 cent only store. You can always switch this out with like maybe a candle. That would be cute. And then finally I have this land of the free because of the braid um, coffee cup. Now um, I know Father's Day is coming up and there's a ton of other coffee cup options you can pick at the Dollar Tree. But I'm going to assemble this and show you how cute it looks like. It's just like a little um, man grillers you know they grill they got their little cutting board they got their utensils they got their little sign they got some something to drink their coffee and then the little snacks while they're barbecuing and this they can put on their desk so let me assemble this and i'll show you guys how it i looks. think this is an adorable gift um really expensive to make it's one two three four five six seven eight about a ten dollar gift really inexpensive to make and like i said you can mimic the same thing just replace some of the items with some dollar tree items like the cup and the decor piece if you don't have a 99 cent only store or um, you can put a candle in its place and it still be really really cute so this is what the box looks like and of course i'm going to shrink wrap it i think it's a really nice inexpensive a little small raffle gift that is a veterans really going to enjoy okay guys let's go ahead and start shrink wrapping Showed you guys how to shrink wrap in a while so we're gonna go a little bit slower with the shrink wrapping and then the rest the other two I'll go a lot faster but um when you open your bag you'll notice at the bottom you'll have your warning label this should always be at the bottom of your gift so just let you guys know that and then the way I unroll it is I'm gonna show you right now As you can see, I have it like faced down. My warning label is facing me. And all I'm going to do is lift my box and put it in the middle right here. I'm gonna try to get it as close to the middle because that's like your center to um, the box as close to the center as possible. Kind of centered and then I lifted it all the way up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start working my way from the bottom up. And then I'm going to take a short break. I'm going to re make sure it's exactly where I want it. And then I'm going to wrap it up. So I'm going to show you that right now. I stopped midpoint because I want to make sure that everything is placed exactly where I want it. Now, Mama 4, you said you had these little creases in. You need to go back over with your um, blow dryer a little bit more. Don't put it directly on it, but just go over it a little bit more. And the more you do it, you'll see that it'll start loosening up. Now, if you shrink, if you shrink wrap this, let's say on Monday and you want to give it to somebody on Wednesday and it does this because that's what happens is the air comes in and it starts to shrivel a little bit. What all you got to do is just hold it back up and then run your blow dryer back over it again and hold it for a couple of seconds and it'll come right back to life. So I'm gonna continue with this as far as shrink wrapping, but I just wanna let you know when you see this, that means that you still need to continue with your blow dryer. Don't point it directly at it because you'll get a hole. Just continually blow dry and those creases will come out. Okay, let's continue. Right now I'm stopping because now I think I am ready to put my bow in. So Mama 4, let me show you how you do the bow because I know you got a little confused with that. I'm going to show you that. So you're right holding now. the bow. This is the bow. It's laid out. There's two strings that come right here. So what you want to do is you want to grab these two strings and then you want to push down. So just push down, boom, 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 and you got a bow. And that's how you make the Dollar Tree bow that comes with the bow in the bag. My bow, I came out really good. And the only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go back over any creases that I see with my um, heat gun or your blow dryer. And then I'll cut the top and we will call it good. So that is, it's really simple and easy to do. But guys, it takes a couple of practices before you get it down pat. You got to remember, I've been doing these um, gift baskets for a while now. So I got it down to a science but as you continue to do it you'll get better and better at it it just takes a little bit of practice so let me finish wrapping up um, heat gunning this i'm going to go over it one last time cut the top and we are good to go guys 
guys. So this is the final product. I think it came out really cute. I think it's a really nice gift. It's also a great Father's Day gift, especially if you're on a tight budget. Really inexpensive to make, about $10, and it comes out really nice, and it's a really nice little simple Father's Day gift. Okay, so let me shrink wrap the rest, and I'll show you guys what all of the final products so look this like. Is what the finished product looks like. I think they came out really, really nice. I think these guys are really gonna like their gifts. So that is everything I wanted to show you today. I hope you guys are having a fabulous, blessed day. I hope you guys have a fabulous Memorial Day. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos, and I will be talking to you guys real soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.